What is up guys, Zach Scott here playing Animal Crossing New Horizons. Isabel says hello there everyone. Right now in a story, it's 5.30 p.m. on Thursday, April 30th, 2020. There really isn't any news to share today, so I, I suppose I don't have much to say besides my hellos. Though now I think about it, the end of April is already upon us. They say spring has sprung, but before you know it, spring will spring right out of the door. But we won't let that stop us from enjoying May to the fullest, will we? Well then, Isabel signing off. So, I have some news myself. Uh, we can wait till I get to the microphone. Hopefully people sent me fish food, because I got a fish. <laughs> That's part of the news. Um, but perhaps bigger news, more important news, if you saw last episode, you know, oh, I look terrible. I need to fix that. I went to someone's island and changed my hair. I need to fix that real quick. W why is my phone ringing? Hello? This is Timmy from, oh, did I put something in there? Oh, weird, I, I guess I left an item in the drop off box. Don't remember doing that, but that's okay. Uh, news today. Wow, the World Wish Day 2020 fundraiser that I set up in yesterday's video, uh, which I'll probably include this in this video as well. Uh, wow, it's already hit $1,436 at the time of this recording, uh, so it's almost to the goal. Now, I don't know what happens when we reach the goal or exceed the goal. I don't know how YouTube handles that, so I'll know more once that occurs. But good job, everyone. Super fantastic. That goes towards a great cause. That goes directly to Make-A-Wish, by the way. Not, I don't touch it at all. <laughs> so uh, YouTube handles that. goes directly to Make-A-Wish. So I'm very, very happy. Uh, so thank you. Let's see. Um, I, I need to change my look. <laughs> I got to change my look. I can't just do a video like this. I look awful. Uh, I, just, I decided to wear long hair. I don't know why. Let my hair down. I put a bunch of bells in the bank. That's why they're not here right now. Uh, but I got the Zen Fence recipe from, uh, from the person I visited yesterday, and that was super duper cool. And, uh, th that was, uh, I think it was yesterday. Or was it the day before? I'm trying to remember, like, what day it was that I recorded this. But, uh, anyway, it was from, it was from Mariah. So thank you, Mariah, so much for that. And, uh, I hope people don't start sending me the, I mean, I hope multiple people haven't, like, sent me the recipe, but, because, I mean, I did ask for it last episode, <laughs> but, uh, uh, let's see what I can wear today. You know, who knows what I can wear? I can wear this is a cute thing. I always like this. And then um, there we go, looking fantastic. Hold on, let's let's look even better. Uh, I don't know what would look best. Yeah, it looks cool. But I gotta get rid of my hair, like for real. Like I can't just walk around with hair like that. Are you kidding me? Uh, sure. There we go. And then the hat. Yeah, the, the hat's okay. That's okay, but the hair is just not okay. No, I didn't do it! Oh my gosh. Freaking out, sorry. Yes, let's get changed. I really don't have any wand outfits, do I? I haven't even done that, I haven't set that up. Uh, that looks good enough, probably. And then what was it? Let's go back to, uh... Let's be a little angel today. <laughs> let's be a little angel. Maybe it'll bring me luck, I don't know. Um. Gosh, this hair—it looks. I it doesn't look me, does it at all? Like really. All right, done. Let me. Well, I need a mirror. I need a mirror. That's what I need. Uh, so let's go to my inventory, pull out the mirror really quick, and then yeah, we can't. Is this a mirror? No. <laughs> I need to start decorating my bathroom or whatever I'm gonna do. Um, where's I, I need a mirror? All right, let's go to furniture. That that would be where it is, right? Uh, I need a mirror. I mean, if I don't have a mirror, I'm going to freak out because I do not like this long hair. Do I not have a mirror? I have to have a mirror. Right? Are you kidding me? There it is. Bathroom sink. That works. Oh, dang it. How do you... How does he, okay. I thought, sorry, I don't know why I thought I was going to place it. Please. Change... Oh, that doesn't, doesn't count as a mirror. All right. I can't find a mirror. Uh, so I gotta figure out how to change my hair. It's gonna be the number one priority today. Can't look like this. Uh, let's check the mail. Maybe someone sent me some fish food. I don't know. Uh, we got KK Aria, Storm Pocket. Jolly Red sent me my painting, so I can give that to, uh, to Blathers, assuming that's real. Mouse, what's up? Good, last day, good luck catching that fish. Thank you. I think Mouse sent me some fish food. Thank you, Mouse. That's amazing. I can't believe he would do this to me. Or with, for me. <laughs> to me. <laughs> but, uh... So yes, fish bait, 10, that's good. Let's see if we can do it. I'll just open this. Uh, I'll open this as well. This is uh, f uh, the amazing painting. And then, uh, I guess we'll look at more, I, I need to get a mirror first, but let's look at more, maybe, maybe I guess get more fish food, I don't know. Let's go in reverse order really quick. So, uh, Buttermilk sent me my favorite surfboard, thank you. Well, her favorite, not, I don't know about mine. 
Make your island more accessible with this, cowboy sir. Thank you, Buttermilk. I really do appreciate that. Saw her island uh, recently. Five stars. I give it five stars. So I got a surfboard and I got a uh, wheelchair. <laughs> uh, I have a wheelchair somewhere. I had one. I might have sold it. I sold a bunch of stuff. and I guess I accidentally sold my mirror at some point. So let's look at this favorite surfboard. Down by the beach down here. Nice. It's yellow. Turn around. Nice. That's a good look. Ah, oh, that's striped. Okay. Are all these backwards? Oh, that one's just white. Okay. That's much better. The viewer needs to see those. Not me. <laughs> not my character. So thank you for that, Buttermilk. And then, uh, what do we got over here? Shadvi sent me two things. A little something to remember. Chops. No, no thanks. No thanks. I don't need chops stuff. Paraphernalia. This should already, this should be a different color to the one you already own. Okay, great. Well, thank you, dude. Summer lucky bag. Hashtags. Thanks, Shadvi. Uh, what do we get here? This is, uh, to remember. Dang it! Stop, stop wrapping your gifts. <laughs> should be a rule. No more wrap. Military uniform. Here we go. Oh, yeah. I had something like this, but in green. <laughs> so now, like, I'm, I'm like chops. Okay, open it up. I look like a dictator, dude. And then this is a surf, another surfboard. Great. How many surfboards do I need? As many as I can get, apparently. Let's put another one down. Place it. Boom. Oh, wow. Look at this. Surfboard. I got, like, so many surfboards. I like them. Uh, and then, uh, what else we got? We got some stuff from Shariah. Shariah. Roar. Sorry. And then, uh, Ian sent me a couple things. Your museum looks a little bland. That's not true. It looks awesome, dude. Help, I'm drowning. All right, let's, let's get, let's get this straightened out. Hold on. So, Shariah sent me a throwback dino screen. Oh! Boom! Yes! Awesome. Did, did, did he also send me that? That'd be funny if he sent me that too. This is, a, yeah, I got two throwback dino screens. Well, hey, I kind of want it too, right? Life ring. What the heck is this? Does this go in the beach area? I'm really getting my place decorated. Not my place, but, uh, you know what I'm saying. Nice. Dude, I got so much stuff. I'm gonna go put those up there soon. Maybe. I, I don't know if I have a space. I don't know if I planned for it, honestly. Joyce! Rawr! Another... Th okay, what is this? And then Ian sent me two more things. Get those big fishes. Thank you, Ian. Because I do need... Th like, the half... The first part of this video... Yeah, that, thank you. I think I got a bunch of extra fish food. And that's great, because now I can fish. Uh, but what's this roar thing? This is a throwback dino screen. <laughs> I got, like, three throwback... Th Did I mention it or something? And now... Uh, I think I must have mentioned it. But wow, I got like three of them. I don't know if I can use them all, but thank you. Do they all look the same? They all seem to look the same. Wow. Okay, let's go fishing. Um, let's see what I can catch today. Wait, wait, I have something else. What would I miss? Oh, you know what? I think I have a bunch of, uh, yeah, I have a bunch of street lights that I need to pick up. That's okay, we'll get those soon. I guess I'll just keep the long hair for now, and then I'll fish. And then uh, get a haircut somehow. I don't know how. But uh, over here, this is where they usually are. Or this is where they need to be. So I got 30 attempts at using the fish food. I don't think that one's big enough. No, that's not big enough. All right, I don't think it's big enough. I'm going to try anyway. I need Actually, I probably need to go ditch some stuff. Let's see what this is. Yeah. I need to go uh, deal with some stuff really quick. Oh, I need to check my turnip prices because I still got turnips. I sold a bunch of turnips at a friend's place uh, the uh, earlier. Yesterday. The day before. I'm getting my days mixed up. But I sold a bunch of stuff. I'm not sold. Uh, turnips. And I got a bunch of bells put it in the bank. So uh, I still have a bunch, though, in my inventory. So uh, let me head over to Nook's place over here. Nook's Cranny, specifically. The bridge is here. And I guess the house has been moved as well. Excellent. The bridge is here. This is looking great. And then my neighborhood is all up here. This is wonderful. We're going to get this situated. Don't worry, guys. This is looking wonderful. I like it. I'm so happy now. Finally, for once in my life, I can be happy. <laughs> no. Uh, so, yeah. Throwback dinosaur thing could go up here. If I don't know if I can put him there, though. Like, Can I put him like right in there? 
I don't know where they go. Like, I wanted them, but then I was like, do I really want them? <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> so, I stop asking for stuff, because I, I get sent to me, and then I'm like, oh, did I really want that? But for now, I can put one here. This will look nice. I don't know whose this one is, but thank you all three for sending me this. I thought it was the other way. Does this rotate? I think so. Yeah, it rotates. So, you know, I don't know. I don't know what to do with this yet. How do you rotate these things? Whatever. <laughs> this is just going to go up here for now. And I have two more. I'm going to hold on to them. Maybe someone will want them. These are really cool. That's not even centered at all. I don't even know if that's what I want to do. But still, that's nice. They need to make more, more cutouts of those. And then, uh, in terms of selling, I need to buy, I need to donate some stuff to Blathers. That's what I need to do. Because I got, like, a uh, migratory locust from a southern hemisphere island that I went to, uh, I believe, yesterday. Maybe, I'm getting my days confused. So, Blathers, sup, dude? I got some stuff. Who? All right, so let, let's have him tell me. Let's see, tell me about this. Oh, can he tell me about the, uh, he can't tell me about the art. But you can tell me about this migratory locust that I caught. Who, dare I say, ooh. Uh, let's see. The lone migratory locust. It seems like such a harmless hopper as it bounces about in the grass. But beware, when these pests band together and travel in swarms, they leave devastation in their wake. Migratory locusts have gathered by the millions throughout history, wiping out crops and causing famine. That's why I always say, never let a locust hang out with its friends. That is precisely how a plague begins. By the by, it would seem our collection is indeed missing, so he would like that, of course. And then, uh, let me don't, let me ask for something else, or about something else. Uh, I have here a red dragonfly. And he hates it. I won't deny that the wretched red dragonfly is an elegant aeronaut. It manipulates its four wings quite uniquely so it can hover and maneuver throughout the air with ease. But the veins on its wings, what ghastly things! One can't help but gasp at the sight of them. Appalling aerodynamics indeed. By the by, it would seem our collection is indeed lacking a red dragonfly. Personally, I do not mind at all, but professionally, I admit a contribution of this kind will benefit the museum greatly. So, I got three things to donate, including the, those two and then also the painting that I got from Red. Uh, so let's do it. Let's uh, uno dos and trace this, right? There we go. And then he liked them. It is splendid. No need to pull them out. So he's got them. He's got them. I'm good. I am good. I got what I came here for. What do I need to get rid of in my inventory? I got trees. About I don't know what that is. I got oh, I got this stuff from uh, from Mariah as well. I don't know what they are, but we're gonna see what they are. I'm gonna put them out. I'm gonna place them out here. Hey, snake. What's up, dude? Uh, what is this? I can't place it. I can only drop it. What's this? Oh, that's nice. That's pretty. I don't know what the tree's bounty mobile means. No. All right. I'm going to see if I can. I don't need to sell anything necessarily. Uh, but what I could. I, I could sell some stuff. Boa blast. I like that. Fish bait's good. I wish I could just straight up buy fish bait. And then uh, what I'll probably do is I'll, I'll cut to when I actually catch something. If I catch something, if I don't. Oh, God. What if I don't? <laughs> I just realized I only have so much time to do this. I don't want to be up all night trying to catch these things. Uh, this looks interesting. Hello. What do you guys have for me? You got, I think I swear I have this. I might have this. Uh, a fighting game. I think I have the fighting one. But it can't hurt to buy another one. Oh, this is beautiful. I'm interested in a flashy flower sign. I'll buy it. I've seen a lot of people with this on my tours, and I think this would be a great place to put my flowers. No clue if I have this. But I'm going to get it. I'll buy it. I'm going to need to start decorating soon. Uh, so the plants are good. I need to start working on my arcade soon. I don't know if I have the arcade fighting game. I think I do. Are they the same throughout the, the land? Gosh. Let me see if I have this one. This one's a yellow and red guy fighting. It's yellow and red. Yellow and red. I'll say no. It's yellow and red. Now what the heck is this? Oil lamp. Sure, I'll buy this too. And then, uh, yeah, I don't know about that fighting game. Let's see if I have the yellow or red. Turnip prices. 58? That's terrible, dude. 
you got to be kidding me. I still have a little bit more left to sell. Um, so let's look at my site, acturnip, not my site, but acturnip.com, ac-turnip.com. I didn't log it. This is Thursday p.m. Uh, 50, what was it? Hold on. Let me say, say one more time. What was it? 58. Yeah, dude. Oh, yeah. I'm not going to really have uh, any luck with turnip prices for the rest of the week. Unless they're at least above 100, then I'll just sell the rest I have. I already sold a bunch for a lot, but that's okay. Or maybe I'll go to someone else's island anyway. Let's sell. We'll see what happens. Of course. And then... Um, I really... You know, I don't need to sell things anymore because I don't really need the room. So I'll sell these animals. That looks good. Confirm. And then I'm going to go fish. Uh, sounds good. I'm going to go fish. I'm going to go look at the arcade. And, uh, oh, can I buy a mirror? How do I, how do I order stuff? How do I order stuff from you guys? Like, do you have, like, a catalog? Oh, no, it's from the, yeah, it's from here. I need to get a mirror, like, ASAP. I don't know if, I'll, I don't know if I'll be able to, can I craft a mirror? Can I, cra maybe I can craft a mirror. If I can craft a mirror, that'd be great. Snake, what's up, dude? Looking built, Bunyip, what's up? Let's chat. Don't mind me, I'm keeping the peace on a story. I try to do a few patrol jogs every day. I will not mind you then. Marshall, what's up? Hey, hey, Zach. I want to chat. Ah, just look at the sky. Mother Nature always picks on, picks such on-trend colors for the season. <laughs> Good job, Mother Nature. Uh, let's see if I can just craft a mirror. Let's craft. Please tell me I can craft a mirror. Please. <laughs> there's, there's my new Zen fence that I learned. So thank you, Mariah. A lot of people have been wanting to send me that, but I got one now. So thank you. There's the mirror. What do I need? Iron. And I don't have wood. You gotta be kidding me, dude. Wood's all over the place. I don't have wood. All right, well, I got a recipe over here. What's this? Uh, let's take a look. I can't believe I don't have wood on me. This is from Freckles. It's a cherry hat. And I don't, I actually don't know that. Oh, I heard a balloon. There is a balloon coming in. I'll have to remember that. Let's go find some trees that I can uh, hit. Oh yeah, I also have these. Dude, I totally forgot about these. <laughs> I just left these out. My, are you kidding? My pocket's already full? What the heck? Here, let's just drop another one then. Let me just drop my uh, wheelchair here. Same color. Let's go give this a sell also. And then uh, I'm going to go get wood, make the mirror, change my look, then go fish. And so I'm going to do all of that right now. Yes, yes, there we go. That right there is a blue marlin. That was like my first attempt. Very awesome. That is a big boy. Big boy right there. I'm a little angel. So I still got to catch the tuna though. So <laughs> wish me luck on the tuna. I can't believe I caught the blue marlin though. That's that's one. Thank you everyone who sent me plant, uh, fish food. Thank you so much. Let's try again. <laughs> Another blue marlin. Okay, but I need a tuna this time. So, uh, <laughs> so let's give me that, please. All right, I'm back to see Blathers at least to donate this blue marlin so I don't accidentally sell it or something. Uh, but let's make a donation here, and uh, we still gotta catch the tuna. I still gotta make a lot of fish food. But one of these, but let's do the, let's do, oh, how, how do I exit? So, anyway, let's do one more time. Sorry, I didn't mean to, like, back out of it. Uh, make another donation, sure. And I want to donate this blue marlin right there. Confirm. Then tomorrow's May, a new month. I'm excited about that. All right, what's, yeah, tell me about the blue marlin, please. Wonderful, I would love nothing more. The blue marlin has a distinctive angular shape and has and no scales. It is an unusual relative of the tuna. These mighty fish can exceed 13 feet from build to tail. Some accounts even have it fighting with whales. No wonder it's a popular target for sport fishing. Unlike most fish, it seems like a worthy opponent. And there you have it. Fascinating stuff. No, rest assured. So I can sell the others, uh, which is great. But also I can I need to make more fish food. It just, the what you sent wasn't enough. <laughs> no, but I really do appreciate it. Uh, everyone who sent me some fish food. I really do appreciate it. Um, 
I kind of wish there's a way that like you could just re like request that. <laughs> this would just benefit me like like crazy. But like, imagine if I could just like put out an open request for fish food and like the viewers could s just send me fish food. <laughs> that would take. Uh, that would be amazing. That would be amazing. Also, I've had too much fish food at the end. I know that. Uh, so hey, let's. I don't have that arcade machine by the way. I looked it up. So I want to sell a couple fish that I got today. I'm gonna need space by the way if I'm going to uh, sell the cherries too. We got a cute tea table. Sell all of these bad boys. I think we're good. I think I got enough stuff, enough space for things. Confirm. I can just go ahead and buy a slingshot. So I don't have to craft one, right? 15,000 sold. And then uh, let's buy this thing because I don't have this one. Looking at a uh, arcade fighting game. The other was called, I got an arcade combat game. I don't know what the difference is, but limited supply, uh, I'll buy it. All right, that's a lot of money, but sure. Uh, then let's just take a peek in here and uh, see what I can get here. Uh, can I just buy a slingshot? Thanks. I want a colorful slingshot, please. I don't even know what that means, but I'll take it. And then I don't think anything else, but uh, just want to take a look at these. These are nice. Huh. Anyway, I'm good. Let's go, uh, I, I broke it opening up a gift, the last one that I had. Uh, so yeah, arcade fighting game's mine. Slingshot, now I, I gotta do the, uh, the the tedious task of getting uh, clams and then, uh, and, then, and then turning them into fish food. So I'll be right back. This could be something big, what is this? Oh yeah, oh yeah, there we go, yes. There we go, I caught a tuna, it's a little off key. <laughs> Very awesome, big tuna, we got it. Uh, so, thank you goes out to uh, to Yashi, Mouse, and, and Raphael for for sending me uh, fish food. I used almost all of it. I still have one more uh, box. And so I think this was uh, Mouse's. Mouse's, so Mouse's, yeah, because I used both of Yashi's. Mouse's helped me catch my first, uh, my first uh, blue marlin and also the tuna. So thank you so much. Let's go donate that to Blathers because, uh, because yeah, I don't want to accidentally sell it or anything. Sup, cat? Yo, Purdy, what's the word? This is yours. You like fish, right? This one's yours. Seriously, you rock. What do you got? I got you a giant blue marlin. These are pretty, pretty tasty, I hear. <laughs> oh, look at the little blue marlin. It's so cute. Little. It's not allowed. It's so big. Thanks, Zach. I got to treat this like little. No, no, you're supposed to eat it. You're a cat. All right, I got to pick a name. Uh oh. Um, how about. Hmm. Uh, I'm going to be awful at this. I guess I'll just call it Zach for now. No, don't do that. Well, we're at it. Here's a little something from me to you. It's it's a college cardigan. Nice. I think I might have already had one. I wanted her to eat it. Oh, well. That's fine. Blathers will. I mean. Are you sure the Blathers doesn't eat them? I don't know. Let's go put it over here real quick and see what's what. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so, yeah, very awesome. Blathers, what's what? I got a tuna. Big tuna. Uh, make a donation. It's called a tuna. And then, uh, yeah. Yeah, dude. Right there. Tuna. Confirm. Thanks to everyone who helped me with fish food. It actually saves a ton of time. Uh, because that's time I don't have to spend making it. Yes, please tell me about the tuna. Uh, the tuna is a large ocean fish that can reach upwards of nine feet long. Besides its great size, it's notable for continuing to swim even when it's sleeping. Well, to be fair, if it doesn't keep swimming, it won't be able to breathe and will, of course, die. But sleep should be restful. And what? If I were the tuna, I would feel very hard done by. And there you have it. Fascinating stuff, no? Rest assured, all donations are displayed in time of the man. All right. Gratitude. And I have... You guys have my gratitude. Uh, for not only that, but also for the Make a Wish campaign, it's going super well. Um, if if you if you don't have you know the the funds to donate, please spread the word on the previous video. Uh, send it around to your friends and family. Maybe they can get something done. Uh, but and then also I'll be donating myself. But I'm going to reveal that later. Um, so I didn't want to donate to this because I wanted the campaign to just be kind of all organic. You know, you guys doing it. But don't worry, I'll make a donation myself. You'll see. And uh, so let's go ahead. Zach, welcome, welcome. What do you need today? I want to sell because guess what? I got a bunch of fish I can sell. Uh, a bunch more, in fact. I caught some stuff. Uh, red snapper. A couple of these, a couple of those. Sea bass. Ugh. At first, I couldn't tell the difference, but anyway. <laughs> in the shadow size is what I'm saying. 
So confirmed. There you go. And then 10,000 sold. So uh, what we're going to do today, and uh, I think I have enough weeds for this. I'm going to go ahead and make another plot in the neighborhood. Now they've already caught the fish. I, I caught up with all of the April's fish. Uh, and we're, we're going to go over here to craft some more hedges. I could definitely use some more hedges. And then let's. And I'm going to move Cat's house, I think. So that's new. I'm glad I got that, but I don't really want to make the Zen fence at the moment. What I want to make are the hedge fences. My favorite. Craft. I don't know how many more I need, but I got to craft some. And then we're going to make up another plot for the neighbor. It's going to be so great. You guys are going to love it. I'm going to move Cat. I don't know how many I have to make, but keep crafting these. These are good deals. Let's do it. Nicely done. Well, one more. Should I make one more? I don't have any more tree branches. That's okay. I'll get more. Don't worry. There are tree branches all over the place. I said I learned to pick them up. So, uh, just hop over here real quick. So, we still haven't figured out the first row, have we? We haven't. That's because I don't fully know what I'm going to do for the first row. But I'm going to move Cat here. <laughs> you know, I don't, I don't want to do it. Anyway, anyway. Uh, move Cat here. Yeah, so this is about ready. This is ready to go. I didn't realize it was so ready to go. I thought we were going to do a lot of work here. But we got uh, hedges. Let's build it. And then, uh, let's see. Like so. That's where Cat's going to go. And I don't need to necessarily do anything with that brick. But let's enter the... Hold on, so let's look at our Nook Miles Plus. What do we get done today? Um, weave flowers to craft a wreath. I'm not ready for that. I'm not caught up with flowers yet but that's okay and then let's put cat's house there but first I'm gonna continue this road and uh, sorry I forgot to enter the building app the island designer app and start construction Sun is setting it's beautiful here all right we're good we're good kind of skip through that it's like a real disclaimer um, so yeah, we're gonna finish this brick road. I think this looks great. Discord. Discord. Does that mean she messaging me? Hold on. I, I want to tell her I already got it. I already got it. Hold on. Uh, caught it. Alright. I don't know what she was wanting me on Discord for. But I, they were sending me the fish. And, uh... But I caught it, thanks to them. Most thanks to Mouse, because his specific bait was what helped. <laughs> no, but I mean, you know, who's, who knows? Who knows what would have happened if they all hadn't sent me bait? Awesomeness has occurred, and I thank them all. And thank you guys, too, uh, the people who I visited who have sent me bait. I've already lost track of who sent me bait. I apologize for that, uh, but thank you so much. I'm going to need to start crafting more out of here, but Cat's house is going to move right here. And this is the trail that we got. This is not going to be here. This is gonna be like a little, what, what is this? No, I don't think that's gonna be there like that. I don't think I'm gonna do that. Unless I, unless I put like a stool or, or a bench or something. So here we go, gonna continue this as well. And I think my house is gonna, gonna, gonna go there, but I haven't quite figured out what I wanna do with it. Like in terms of the spacing. But there we go. So yeah, this neighborhood's coming along quite nicely. Let's move Cat's house. I don't know what else to put where, but uh, things are looking quite nice, right? I think so. I might also consider putting in floor lights around here, like, but I don't know yet either. <laughs> don't let me decide anything yet, please. What's that noise? I mean, I know it's a balloon, but where is it? Is it going to come over here? Probably not. Let's get this down. I bought my slingshot. I didn't make this slingshot. I bought it. Uh, and then let's shoot down like so. Awesome. Now, here's the question. I don't know. Do I want... She's, she's asleep. Do I, let's think about the positioning of these animals. Do I want... Oh, man. That's a good question. Do I, I could always switch them later if I really wanted to switch them around. But 
I thought Cat could be here because it's like Cat could be here because it's like most accessible. Apollo's up there. Those are my two favorites. You know what I mean? And then snakes over here. Maybe I could put another cat here. But no, I mean like a kid, like a cat creature. Like you know what I'm saying, right? I could put the other Anka here or something. But maybe Cat would want to be by the beach. I don't know. I gotta start thinking about that. Like who's gonna want to be by the beach more? And I don't have an answer to that. Hope everyone likes their um, their fencing. <laughs> so uh, let's. Uh, let's then I mean everyone's kind of living in the same area right this kind of looks like a I hope it's not too homogenous you know what I mean I hope it's not too I don't know I think it looks good but we're gonna we're gonna keep working on it of course and uh, so I think I'm gonna move cat there now I was gonna maybe do another incline but I don't know if that's a great idea right now uh, this by the way does not go here hold on if I get the here, like if I get the regular shovel out, I can scoop some of these, get these flowers out of the way, and then we can fix this road up and how it's gonna go. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna need flowers gone here. Oh come on, trusty shovel. Let's get a colorful shovel. The store's right here. And see, here's the thing. I'm already thinking about taking shortcuts. Like, I'm already, like, shortcut, so I could kind of, I mean, maybe there should be a path here. <laughs> Probably not, but maybe, but maybe there should be a path here. But it's not, no, well, maybe. Can a, I don't think a path can even fit here. No, a path can't fit here how I would want it to. Never mind. <laughs> it was a good idea while, while I had it. Uh, no, I don't think a path should be there. Unless, no, probably not. I mean, that's not a bad idea. Unless, <laughs> no. no, I don't think the path can fit there. So, like, if we look at here, like, there's the path's not gonna fit. Let's double check, though. Yeah, see, that's as close as it gets. I mean, it could fit. It would be like a little tiny path, right? I could put like a stone path. That might be cool, especially now that uh, there's no other shop next to it. But there will be a shop next to it. So let's think about let's think about the future. You know what I mean? What? No, don't do that. Here we go. Great. Uh, yeah, I'm here to buy a shovel. I'm just gonna flat out buy it rather than craft it. Why craft it when I can just buy it, right? Ari, what's wrong? Ari's whining for some reason. I think someone's outside. Let's buy a shovel. Do these shovels last? I don't even know. This is a printed design shovel. I don't even. Okay, I'll buy it. Sure. So no, it's such a weird design. But hey. It's gonna move on. Thank you. Thank you. I bought like everything in the store today. Um. So yeah, let's go ahead and move Cat's house over there. Why did I buy a shovel? Oh yeah, to get the flowers out of the way. <laughs> Already thinking about the shortcut. This is my shortcut to the bridge. And uh, always think about foot traffic, you know. But of course, I won't be able to. Nope. I won't be able to make uh pass if there's a building there. So hopefully, I get a new building to put in soon. May Day, I believe, is tomorrow, correct? Let's see. All right. Yes, looking good. Now, I, the rest of this, you know, I don't, I'm getting to where I don't exactly know where to put flowers, but I know that there's gonna be flowers along the path. I just don't know what type, but I could, uh, you know, I could drop some here. See how it looks. I mean, where else are they gonna go? You know what I mean? Eventually, I'm gonna move them to like a farm section. You know what I mean? That's not too bad, right? Like if there's like a, yeah, that, that looks, that looks okay. I don't know if what I'm doing is right or wrong, but this looks okay. And I gotta think about stuff that, you know, maybe Apollo or Cat would want. I've been giving Cat all of her stuff. I hope she doesn't put that fish in her house and just take up a lot of space. But if she does, it's her choice. I give her the fish to eat. She wants to keep it as a pet, that's fine. Alright. And over here. So this is what this is what's happening with this. And then I think my house is gonna go here. And I think this is going to be a good look. I won't mess with any more flowers right now. 
But this is how my neighborhood's shaping up. And you know, maybe like a street light right here or so. I really don't know. Um, I could make the, the paths a little more intricate. Like maybe some benches along here. I don't know. But you would want benches normally to be facing outwards. You know, in a, in a situation like this. But they could be facing inwards. Um, yep, yeah, let's move cap. And I'm not ready to put in another br bridge yet. I don't really have a space. I want to put one like in the same area over here, but that's going to take a lot of digging, and it's also going to require me to move Pashmina's house. So I'm going to probably move Pashmina next to Apollo. Uh, so that's how it's going to go. And so Apollo, uh, Cat's going to be here. Pashmina's going to be next to Apollo, probably. Or Amelia. I don't know. Pashmina might be next to... I don't know. I don't have Amelia yet. We'll talk about it when we get there, right? Pashmina could be on... But you know, actually, I could give Pashmina a nice little beachside area. I think she might like that. Have two of the sisterly, uh, you know, villagers, townspeople, islanders living here on this row of homes. Uh, or as I like to call them, stepsisterly. So let's go talk and move Cat. And see if she's cool with that. And plus, I haven't even checked the machine in here yet. So let's do that. Ba -da -ba -boo -boo. All right, welcome to the next stop. Thank you. And so let's uh, redeem Nook Miles, I suppose, and see if there's just anything. You know what? I don't need special. F I think I have all the fences now, so I don't need special fences anymore. Tomorrow's May Day. I could order more, a bunch of stuff like this. Uh, let's see. Yeah, let's let's piece out of that, and then let's go see what else we got uh, at the Nook shopping section. See what kind of stuff I can hoard. Camping set, I have both of those. DJ KK, I don't think I have that. Let me double check though. Uh, we're talking DJ KK. I don't see it. I don't see it. DJ KK is is gonna be something I order. That'll be good. Place the order. Good. Now let's move a villager, and then uh, we'll be done with today's episode. And then you know, if I happen to clean out an, air, an area and put up a you know, no, not there. That's not what I want to do. Let's exit that, please. Jump over here. All right, this is the construction consultation counter. What? Uh, let's ooh, talk infrastructure. Let's chat. Uh, layout changes. And I want to move an island home. We're talking about cat. Moving cat. I should really move Pashmina, but I just want to get cat in place. Yeah, let's do that. Uh, let's do it. Bring cat in here. Let's see what she has to say about this. Maybe she'll like it. I think that covers everything. So, cat, do you want to move where Zach thinks you should move? Yeah, sure, I'm in. I was just thinking it was time for a shakeup. Point the way, Purdy. Excellent. All right, then. Sounds great. You just leave the rest to me and our friend Zach. Awesome. Boom. Let's do it. And then now I have the thing to put in. All right, new spot for Cat's home. Let's do it. One villager at a time per day until this neighborhood is complete. And then, um, yeah. That's good. I don't know where Marshall's going to live. He might live north of Apollo. Again, I still need to read, kind of think about this. I think it's going to be three by three. You know? We'll see. We'll see how this ultimately goes. But my home, I could see my home definitely being here. But with a bigger yard, maybe. Like, maybe I, maybe I have the yard of, of two. Two. <laughs> the yard of two people. That's fair, right? And then, uh, let's just put cat, cat up here. Hold on. I'm trying to think. I mean, if I put her here, yeah, I think this is fine. So, looking at the map, hold on. Let's look, let's pull up the map really quick. If I end up doing, so there's one, two, three, four. There's ten people. If I end up doing three by three, that's nine. Then I'll have to keep. I'll have to have another person. So I could do it such that, oh man, this will take a lot of work. But if my house is here, I can move Cat next to me by the beach. But that's a lot of work to actually get squared away. I don't know for sure that I'm moving there 
for example. That's another thing. I don't really know. And then, um, you know, I don't, I don't know. I, I mean, I think that could look good for a neighborhood. Like I could be the, the king of the neighborhood, you know? How much space does my house need? I need to look that up because if I didn't leave enough room for my own house, that's something I didn't even think about. I have a, on my Discord, someone posted a, uh, let's see, someone posted, what did they post? Hold on, I'm looking it up really quick. It tells you the space of the... There we go. My dog is whining. Uh, Ursa, it's okay. Ursa, chill out. So Ashley's playing with the dogs right now. She takes them out one at a time because they'll fight. If she doesn't do, you know, they'll like they'll fight if they're like together playing with the same toy. And so Ashley has to take them out one at a time to play with them. And when like one's out, the other one gets kind of jealous and like starts like whining or something because they want out. Etc. Anyway, uh, so on my Animal Crossing chat, I think someone posted it. Are you kidding me? It doesn't have any pins? There it is. This Discord's loading weird. So houses. So yeah. So it's still four. Interesting. Hmm. So yeah, my house would be like this. I don't know how my porch would go. So if I end up putting my house over here, which we could do, I don't know if he'll do my house at the same time, but uh, basically, villager homes are four by five. Oh, they're five by four? Wait, what? Oh, what? Hold on. They're five by four. What? Okay, I see what they're saying. Five spaces, so it's not quite Sorry, I'm looking at something that you guys can't even see right now. <laughs> so, uh, I think the, the the math is a little weird here. They, they're saying there's five and then three. That's not what I consider five by three, honestly. Like, like so they're saying that like Able Sisters is five by three. If you look at this, I don't know if I agree with this chart, but it's five across. You know, one, two, th three. Oh no, no, they got it right. Never mind, they got it right. Sorry. <laughs> and then it's three over here. Uh, yeah, one, two, three. Correct. Right. Hold on. Let me see. Let me see. Let me go ahead and just. I'll double. I'll double check this here. But yeah, I'm pretty sure it's one, two, three. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So this is five by. Unless they count. Does they count that? Hold on. One, two. Yeah, because I can't walk behind it like that. So, yeah, it does require three spaces. So, yeah, it is five by three. So, my bad. So, then my house. Uh, so, my house instead. So, the villager houses are uh, four by five, typically. Uh, with. I don't know. I'm, I'm, I'm misunderstanding it completely. <laughs> I've already laid out the houses. We know how long how long they are, right? So the villager houses. I, I apologize for this. This is why. This is why. Man, this is why so much of my neighborhood building happens off camera. <laughs> but we've already figured it out, right? We have uh, four. This is this is how many deep? This is one. That's one, two, three. Four by one, two yeah, by five. That's four by five. But the the fact that it says your house is five by four, what does that even mean? Let's go figure it out really quick. I'm thinking about just moving my house over there, and then building cat a space next to me. Uh, but we will see, because that'll squeeze her in. It's purely for utility purposes. My house. Yeah, so I have a, a step up to my house. So let's uh, let's remove this. Let's uh, let's build a. Uh, let's say I have a brick path, right? I still have the three spaces, but here's the thing: the three spaces are. You know, I don't need as long of a porch either, so if there was an issue with my house, I can still move up one. So, can I not, I can't put that there because the mailbox is there.
But you see there's one, two, three, and then one on each side, right? So that is five. Wait a second. Sorry, I get so confused. And then over here, looking back at the house, this is, yeah, I, okay, I get it. Yeah, so no, it's four by, four by, where's the five? Hold on, what? What do they mean five? Villager house is four by five? Oh, cause they're counting, oh, they're counting this space too? Oh, because you have to have the spaces there to even put it in. You have to have the clearing. Oh, I see what they mean now. So they mean four. Okay, that makes sense. There's one, two, three, four. But it's they're four by four, but you actually need this, this space here to put them down. So that's what they mean by four by five. And then five by four means, yeah, okay, I get it now. I get it, I'm fine. So, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm comfortable moving my house down there soon and just kind of putting it like this and I hope this would look good and I would just have a bigger yard, like a much bigger yard and I'll brag about it to my neighbors. So let's, uh, let's, let's then, let's do it. Let's move in, let's move in cat if we can and this is going to be a little bit of a struggle because we're going to have to put down a lot of hedges and stuff to actually make this start working but basically, uh, and I don't have a lot of sticks but I can make more hedges so... Uh, we know that it goes all the way across here and I'm gonna have to move some trees Which means oh my gosh. Am, am I gonna ever have to move trees? What the heck? This is a much bigger endeavor than I originally thought about But this will help us get our uh, This will help us get it done quicker I think So let's shake this guy hold on let me I need sticks. Let's just shake Let's just shake it. Give me some sticks while you're at it, tree. I need some sticks to make these hedges. Thank you. Oh boy, this is gonna be a lot a lot more trouble. I might go off camera for some of this, because uh, this is gonna be a lot of trouble, but we're gonna have to move these trees. I don't necessarily need to move this one, honestly. I can just chop it down. Uh, but let's just, uh, let's, let's, mm, let's move it, because I, I don't know. Let's move it, why not? Let's eat a tree, or eat an orange. This is gonna be a much bigger endeavor th today than I realized, but I'm gonna eat like, dang it. I need like several of these oranges here. What was in my present? I didn't even look at my present that dropped from the sky. Uh, open up, this is a rattan armchair. Eat the, there you go. And then, uh, so if we're going across here, Sure, orange tree come with me. And uh, let's do, let's cover this up. We know that this was coming, this day was coming. Here we go. I might give myself my own pond, who knows. Like what if I don't need? What if I don't, what if I'm not finding that I need any, <laughs> any help with that? Here we go, uh, up over here. Yeah, this is only the second house. See, I'm gonna have a very long yard. I don't know if I like that. No, you know what? I was thinking about it being a community center. My house may not even go here. Like this this front area might just be a community center. I don't even know. I don't know where my house is, my house is gonna go. Let's be real, I don't know where my house is going to go. If I did nine by nine, and then one house more, then I can put a community center, and then I can put my house, I don't know, I could always just put a community center anyway, like some sort of like workout area, I don't know. Instead of giving, I'm trying to think about like, do I really want a long, a big yard? I mean, do I, is that something I really need? Probably not. Anyway, let's, uh, here, let's just, well, yeah, let's go with the plan. My house being like the king of the king, the king of this area, you get out here, my house is boom, on the corner here. I'm the house, yeah, I'm the house that's the, the face of the neighborhood. And then we gotta fit 10 more people, so we have a nine by nine above it. And there's either a community center, well the whole thing was I didn't know where to put cat. This could be like a, some sort of community center, or farm even, like it doesn't have to be my house, you know what I'm saying? 
you get you guys get it right let me let me just bear this i don't know where i'm putting cat is all i'm saying because if i have my house in the nine by nine there still needs to be a tenth house this is the most confusing part of the game I'm just trying to just figure out where things go so uh let's cover this up because we know we need to do that first but i hope you appreciate me talking through this i don't know if you do and is 10, like, going to be the forever maximum in terms of villagers? Because we could... I don't know. We could have a... You know, I, I said I was going to try to forget symmetry. 10 really makes it hard. It makes it easy to forget symmetry. Because, you, you know, you have 3 by 3 and then an extra one. And so what do you do? don't know the answer to that by the way i'm just that was a rhetorical question what do you do i don't know so uh we can leave those flowers there for now because we're not going to be moving my house but we are going to use this is a gauge we're gonna put things something here we're gonna have to move these let me shake out some more oranges really quick go ahead and collect these and any six that fall along with it if six want to fall there you go. Because I need to make more hedges, of course. Then I'll eat a couple of these. I'll move the trees somewhere else. I don't know where I'm going to move them. They'll just be in my inventory, I think, for a little bit. These are orange trees without the oranges. Still useful, especially for farming. But this must be close to Nook. Nook's cranny. I like that. Location. That's like I think that's my number one thing in this in this game. Is I want to be sure that things are located in a way that makes sense. I need another one. This is basically me. No. Ugh. I was having a snack attack. And now. No, I'm not. There we go. go there's a shovel and oh man I really hope that this fits we'll have to see what happens there may not be a way to have a path on, uh, I was really hoping there would be a path on the other side but now I don't know if there will even be a path on the other side of this oh dear what if it doesn't fit I didn't even think about that but the path could just be the beach you could just walk along the beach you don't have to have a path uh, path here you can just walk along the beach like, you could just go out to the beach, and you can use the beach to access it, maybe. Just an idea. I need to eat some more oranges, get some more of these trees out of here. Alright. Uh, three more oranges, please. I mean, a lot. This is... Dang it! <laughs> this keeps killing me, man. This, this game... Eat this. And then eat another one. I really got to see if we we're able to. And I haven't really been measuring. I mean, I've been measuring, but I haven't really been paying attention to what I need. We'll do something with these trees later. I don't know what. But some of you guys requested to see me build more and more. And thus, this is the result of that. So, uh, knowing now that this is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, right? Because there's, no, this is, no, sorry, this is two. So, there, yeah, there's six in between. That's right. I made sure there were six in between these areas. So, wow. Okay. We don't need to worry too much about this. We know that the second slot typically starts here and okay let's think about this I you know what let's just start here let's just uh, knowing that there's six spaces in between let's just put down sand or whatever right here so we got uh, one my dog I don't know if you can hear my dog whining in the other room my apologies one I can even see two and there's two Oh, no. Ursa, stop. Three. Ruining the video. <laughs> uh, three. Dang it. Hold on. Three. 
four. What? Why'd you flip around? That's four. Five. And then one more. Six. That's six. And then, yeah, it, there's no room for a path. But the good news is, is that you can kind of have a path if you just go on the beach. Like you could just like, you can, uh, you can just walk to the beach from the from the house or from the street, and then use the beach to walk around. I don't have to have a, an official path. I don't have to have a path that like goes vertical here. You know, it doesn't have to be that good. <laughs> if I wanted it that good, I don't want the neighborhood here. I would want to do uh, a two by two essentially, which I could do. I could do a two by. I could do like yeah. Hmm. That would put me all the way up north. Uh, is there room for doing a five by a five by two? Is what I mean, not two by two, but a five by two. And then plus another one for me, and then a community center. Uh, I don't know. That would be six by two. One, two, three, four, five. I mean, that would probably work. But do we want it to work? I don't think so. I think this is fine. I don't want to waste a ton of space. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, yeah, I don't know. Man, and of course... The whole caveat of all this is if it, this doesn't work out, I can always change my mind. I can always change my mind. I don't have to stick to it. And I might end up doing it. People redo their islands all the time, right? So we're talking about a hedge being here, down here, even with this tree. And yeah, that is what we're talking about, isn't it? Because the hedge starts here. So we bring out the hedge and we could put cat down here in some fashion. Um, if I want to, I think, and I think I do want to. Where's, there we go. All right, build the fences. That's not it, hold on. Is that it? That's, that starts, okay, so yeah, with the hedge lines up here. Yeah, 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 okay, and then this hedge is here as well. And then it goes down here, however many it goes, you know. And then, uh, but more importantly, well, how many does it go? Let's find out. It goes one, two, it was four hedges, I think, down, right? This is two, one, two, Four hedges down. It's already one, two. No, it's already not there. I hear a balloon. Do I have space for a balloon? I could. If it's not already gone over the ocean. Oh, that's coming this way. Missed. No, it's going away. Come on. Thank you. Let's see what we got. Maybe we got some sort of. Uh, who knows? Cypress bathtub, nice. So yeah, thinking about, uh, here, let's just put more hedges over here too. If I have space for them. I never remember where the uh, inventory is. So we were thinking about, you know, my house going over here somehow. And I might just put it in the middle and uh, give myself like a really nice, uh, I could give myself a uh, a wall. <laughs> All right, but no, but you could, you guys get the idea, right? This is like how how it's gonna go. My house will eventually go in here somehow. I really don't want anything too fancy for myself that I know of. I, I might be wrong, but yeah. So it goes all the way down there. Perfect. I think, right? Because we we planned it out this way. How many did I do? I did one, two, three, four. That's the fourth one. So this is one, two, three, yeah, four. I gotta measure it correctly, right? I think so. Yeah, absolutely. Okay, great. Thus, uh, we know that this particular path uh, is here. We know that it, it's it's a one above because we kept the spacing like that. And. Uh, there we go. I do apologize if this part's boring, but I mean, like, 
it's, it's, it's a hard balance. Some people want to see this, some people don't. And so I'm giving half the people what they want. <laughs> the other half, I mean, at least I caught the fish. And, you know, the, the beauty of YouTube is that you can just kind of skip videos if you don't like it, you know? You can just kind of, uh, like, oh, if you, don't, if you don't like it, you can fast forward. You can go to the next five minutes from here. But this is going to be, I think, good look for us. I like how it just walks out to the beach. That's super nice. I want If I was someone living here, I wouldn't even have a fence on the, on the other side. I would just have it open up. And maybe that's the uh, the real pleasure that we're going to give uh, the people who live beachside. We have the cats live beachside. That'd be nice. Of course, I don't know if I'll have any more cats. But cats going to move here. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure I've decided that. I, I, I'm going to have a giant yard. And there's not going to be a community center in this area. Unless there is. But for now, there's not. <laughs> so... Uh, new plan. Oh, God. I hate when I do that. Uh, it was this one, right? Favorite it. No. Okay. Favorite it. You had the perfect spot for it. Right there. And then I gotta upload this video. I, I've spent a lot of time playing today. And, uh, it's like... That's why my videos sometimes go up late. So I'm just playing Animal Crossing this whole time. Hedges. Build a fence. Here we go. So, six between. One... Two, three, four, five, six, between. And then, uh, then we go one. There we go. Two. I uh, maybe I could put some flowers there. I don't know. What? There you go. Look at that. And then it's ready for Cat's house to be put in here. I don't think I can move my house now. But if I can, I'll do it. But they may not let me. So let me uh, let me just go ahead and finish this up really quick. Because I gotta upload this video. <laughs> this is how this looks. Nice little. It's not a driveway, but it's a you know porch. So Cat's house is actually going down here now. So, Cat lives just to the left of me. Apollo lives just uh, two spots above me. <laughs> oh, well. That's okay. I thought Cat was going to go here, but instead Cat's going to go over here. And then, uh, maybe Pat... Actually, I think Pashmina is going to go up here. Because she'll be next to Snake. Because my two original villagers here. And that'll be nice. And then maybe above here will be Amelia if I get her. And then over here will be uh, Anka right here. So that's that. That's what I'm thinking about doing. And I know that I've effectively ruined the terrain of my island in this section to flatten it to build a neighborhood. But do not worry because... Uh, because it doesn't matter. <laughs> no, I don't know. Uh, I don't know. Let's put it put it, this in here really quick. Cat, you're going to love your new home. Uh, there you go. Cat's kit. Kit cat. That looks good to me. Let's envision it, though. And then... Oh, yeah. That's Cat's home. That's a great spot. Okay. So. Nook Inc. will be moving uh, her in here. I don't think I can move my house now. If I can, though, I mean... Heck, I would do it. That would make a lot of sense. Let's see if I can move anyone. Can I move other people's house? I think it's only one a day. But I'm, I'm going to be flabbergasted if I, if I could have if I could have moved like other people... Let's see if he'll move my house really quick. I don't think he will, because he'll be like, I'm sorry, we're already doing construction on Cat's house. But if he will move my house, I will do that too. All right. All right, let's see it. About my home. I want to relocate. Oh no, he's positive pool moving, moving. So anyway, we got it. Tomorrow, uh, maybe I'll move my home. Actually, I'm going to move Pashmina's home next because I need room over there. But thanks for watching. We caught all the, I have all the critters now for the this month. And then uh, next month is a new month. May. Goodbye. I'm Zach Scott. Subscribe if you have not. If you like this video and want to help this channel grow, all you got to do is click the like button below. Thank you so much for watching. You can now join and become an official member of Zach Scott Games. And if you want cool shirts like this, visit ZachScott.shop.